man who was last seen swimming near Point Reyes over the weekend has now been identified. Friends tell us 52-year-old Felix Louis Njai was a San Francisco tech entrepreneur who was attending a wedding Sunday with friends near Wildcat Beach. His friends claim that he was attacked by a shark while swimming. His body has still not been found. Today, his friends also say Njai was a beloved member of the kite surfing community in San Francisco. KTVU's Crystal Bailey live tonight at Chrissy Field, where he spent a lot of time enjoying the bay there. Crystal. Well, officials have not named the missing person, but friends of Felix tell us he spent a lot of time here at Chrissy Field. You could always catch him on the water, kite surfing, kite foiling, kite boarding. He was a big member of the kite community, but they tell us that's not all he was. There's more to him, and he was more of a kind. One of Last seen on Sunday, his friends say Felix Louis Njai was attending a wedding at the remote Wildcat camping ground, taking a swim with friends who tell us he was attacked by a shark and never resurfaced. This is just unbelievable. On Sunday, crews from multiple agencies supported the search. The Coast Guard suspended their search on Tuesday, but the National Park Service is still on the lookout, calling it a recovery effort. This sort of thing just doesn't happen. But his friends don't want his death sensationalized. They want people to know him for who he was and the warmth he shared with everyone. Big smile, engaged, present, and just an amazing person. That was his attitude towards life. They tell us Felix brought people together from all walks of life. He had an impact that was well beyond the kite community. Um, he was uh, an inspiration to many. He was a mentor for many young people. And he was also an intrepid entrepreneur. Like he's, he, you know, from the ground up, like, you know, startup, startup, startup. You could always catch him on the water or on the slopes. He's the kind of guy who always had um, just an amazing sense of adventure. His friends saying the spirit of Felix lives on in the water. Every track on this water he's been over. And the search continues with the National Park Service. Officials telling me they had people on the ground on the shoreline of the beach where he was last seen. They also had air support thanks to Yosemite's helicopter who was visiting at the time. They tell me today, though, that they're actually scaling back their search. They will, of course, continue to keep an eye out. Live in San Francisco, Crystal Bailey, KTVU, Fox 2 News.